All right, runners, get ready. Registration is now underway for the 21st annual Lake Michigan Credit Union Bridge Run. Here to tell us more about it, the Credit Union's Vice President of Community Relations, Matt Cook. How you doing? I'm doing great. Thanks for having us. Yeah, this is such a great event, and it's been going on for so long. What can we expect this year? Yeah, so similar to last year for any of the viewers that participated, uh, we had a chance to be able to welcome over 2,000 runners last year um, back to downtown Grand Rapids. We moved the starting line from Rosa Park Circle over to the west side of the river uh, by the Sixth Street Bridge. And so we're going back to that location this year. Uh, we have a 5K event as well as a 10 mile run. That 10 mile run will run uh, through downtown alongside the 5K runners and then when the 5k runners are finishing uh, around the three mile mark the 10 milers will run north to Riverside Park and so uh, that'll be familiar to anybody that's participated in the past but um, we're excited and anticipating uh, potentially the largest uh, number of registrants that we've ever had. Oh, that's so exciting. It really is just a great scenic tour of the city. It is. It's one of those routes that amongst all the different events that we have in West Michigan, uh, our route is unique in the sense of that you get to cross the number of bridges across the Grand River, uh, but also be able to take in all that's happening downtown. It is the Sunday just after Art Prize starts, so you'll be able to see some of the outdoor exhibits that are happening during Art Prize, uh, but then also a number of people downtown and all of the volunteers to be able to cheer everybody on that's coming out. Yeah, well, what a great race. And of course, a portion of it um, goes to benefit some local charities. What are those this year? Yeah, so we are really excited, uh, really since the start, My Team Triumph, uh, which you'll find a, a number of the events locally, uh, is one of the benefactors of this race, and so they're great partners, and so they'll start a couple minutes before um, our other walkers and runners. Uh, and then we also partner with No Surrender Running Club, which is a great local nonprofit organization that has a mentorship model uh, for youth uh, that want to be able to kind of work up their way to the bridge run. And so that's a great opportunity for them to be able to come and celebrate and those that are participating or maybe coming out to cheer on these youth are a lot of times participating in the longest run they've ever done on that Sunday and so we're excited to welcome uh, the participants from both my team triumph and no surrender running club uh, out and uh, proceeds from the event will also go back to those nonprofit organizations as well oh that's wonderful it always is so great to see those younger kids running so tell us again when it is a couple of weeks now yeah, so Sunday, September 17th will be the LMC Bridge Run. We're excited. Uh, that day, it'll start at 8 a.m. Uh, there's festivities happening beforehand. So uh, for those that want to register, uh, you can start registering now, uh, and we would encourage you to do so to guarantee your shirt. Uh, but also then uh, that morning, we'll have, if you haven't picked up your packet, either on the Friday or the Saturday before the race, uh, you can still do so that morning. Um, and then the race will start at 8 a.m. and we'll have a finish line festivities happening afterwards as well. All right, yeah, busy weekend. We'll hope for good weather too. Indeed, that's always one of those sweet spots of, you know, the beautiful weather here in uh, Michigan yeah. in a fall morning. So hoping for some warm temperatures, no uh, precipitation and, yeah. um, and people can find out more at thebridgerun.com as well. Okay, good, sounds great. Okay, well, great to talk to you today. Really appreciate it. Thanks so much for having us. Thanks.